I'm back and I'm going to review some more games. How about that? Real quick recap in case you didn't watch the last video. Basically, I'm going back through every game I've ever played and reviewing them and putting them all on this site on my profile on this site so everything's all in one spot so I can point to it whenever anybody asks what I feel about ga certain games or whatever. Just give them this list and you know everything about me. Literally everything. So, what is next? I'm going through them alphabetically. I'm currently on the letter F. Apparently there's not actually a zero there. It's just a capital O. Uh, we have Flow. <laughs> The, uh, that game company that first put them on the map, you'd literally just play as a little sperm thing and, and fly around the ocean or something. I, are you in the ocean? I don't remember. This company made Flow, then Flower, then Journey. Uh, Flower is actually the next on the list because it's obviously almost spelled exactly the same way. So we're going to do Flow and then Flower right afterwards. Honestly, this game is stupid. That's my review. Uh, I think I did complete it. Uh, why would I enjoy being a sperm? Create log. That is my official review of flow. Now, let's go to flower. Spoilers. <laughs> also not fun. Also just completely pointless. Also completed. Was quite a waste of time. Honest. All right, moving on. What's next? Oh, boy. Fortnite. What the heck? Oh, my God. All the seasons are listed separately? Vibin? Yeah. What the heck do I even say about Fortnite? How do you review Fortnite? So, I played this when it first came, when the Battle Royale portion first came out in 2017. I think it came out in 2017 with this, with the, the single player part, whatever. doesn't matter. Whenever it first came out, I played it for the first couple months. I enjoyed it quite a bit, um, but then I was like, all right, well, moving on. That was uh, a fun little romp. Let's, and then I went back to uh, Rainbow Six Siege because it's better in every way. And then I went away on vacation for a couple months, came back, and Fortnite was just, like, just massive. And I was like, what? Why? It's just, it's... It's just whatever. It's just another throwaway game, but it's as big as Minecraft now for some reason. Like, as important as Minecraft. Which, I, I just... It doesn't deserve that at all because it doesn't really do anything well enough. It's almost like my issue with Grand Theft Auto in that it does a bunch of things pretty well, but overall, it's really not special. Uh, but it just gets lumped, praise lumped on it for whatever reason, just because it does a bunch of things. Um, so I think it really, and at this point, it's 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 popular for various reasons. I could talk forever about Fortnite, but I'm not going to. As a video game, oh, I should also say I revisited it, revisited it this year with the zero build thing, and it's much better. Not much better. The The main thing I didn't care for when playing it, when I originally played it, was the building part. I was like, this part... Everything else I like, but the building I didn't care about. And then when, like, Call of Duty had Warzone, like, Warzone, Apex Legends, to me, were both definitely better than Fortnite. Um, I've just never really gotten super into a Battle Royale. But anyways, now I think Fortnite... Fortnite. <laughs> Fortnite is, like, on par, I guess, with the zero build mode, um, with something like Warzone. Uh, but again, I don't really play them. But, um, what would I rate it? How do you rate a game like this? Finished with a game that lacks an ending. Sure, that'll work. Played it on PS4 and PS5. I guess I'll put PS4. Can't pick more than one for some reason. What do I give it? What did I give? So let me see. I got to see. This is where I need to compare it to other things that I've already rated. Okay, so I put Modern Warfare, the reboot of Modern Warfare, at three and a half. Destiny at three. Yeah, that's where it's going. It's, it's good, but it... It does not deserve the popularity and praise that it has gained over the past five years. Definitely not. But also, going out of your way to hate on it is kind of equally dumb. So, whatever. It's solid. What do I write about it? Let's see. Well, fuck, I already said so many things. What, <laughs> what's the point of writing? Well, I guess I do have to put it on the site. One second. This game does not deserve its popularity. However, hating on it and claiming it sucks is equally as silly. It's a pretty good game, especially with zero build, but it's not really special in any regard. 
I generally prefer to play a shooter that is more well-rounded with multiple modes to offer. Even something like Warzone is preferable to me as I feel like Call of Duty is unbeatable when it comes to how it feels to play. Or you could go for the slower route and enjoy something like Rainbow Six Siege for a more tactical style. Fortnite just hovers in the middle of a bunch of categories and doesn't really stand out in any way. Sort of like Grand Theft Auto. And that's that. Maybe I will stick to like three games per video generally. We'll try that. Um, so that's going to be it. This one's going to be probably a lot shorter than the last one. And what a uh, group of games. Flow, Flower, and Fortnite. <laughs> the evolution. The true evolution of video games. I'll see you in the next video. Hope you enjoyed. Uh, be sure to check out the description for the Twitch channel. Um, which is Diguns. It's also the name of my uh, account on this website. Uh, I'll maybe I'll link the backlog backlogged account Twitch and Patreon. Speaking of Patreon, thank you to Mex, Bookie, Sion, Eddie, Echo, and Kinoff for supporting me over there on Patreon. You can too if you would like. Keep in mind, as of right now, unless I changed it, the tiers are a little bit uh, whack, um, not accurate. But I will get to editing that as soon as I possibly can. Thank you. And I'll see you next time.